Alright, how is everybody doing today? I am back here with episode 2 now of the Pittsburgh Force Expansion My League Realistic Rebuild. And you guys freaking killed the like all. I asked for like, what, 750? I think you guys got a thousand more than I asked for. I think you guys gave me 1,750 likes plus. You guys are the freaking best and I'm glad you guys are ready for this series because I know I am. I did read like most of the comments and I did get your guys' opinions on it. So, one, you guys said move most space to power forward because he goes up. And he goes up to a 76. A bunch of you guys said that because he can maybe start over Johnson. And also people said don't play like all these centers and give give Ennis minutes. And then we can play Spates because uh, Siakam's hurt. Josh Richardson, you guys said like use him a lot. Like he's going to be really good. Also, you guys also wanted to do what I wanted to do, which I loved. You guys said build up Azili or CJ Miles and trade him to a contender at the deadline, which I guarantee I'm doing. And I'm, I really like that idea. So thank you all for your suggestions. Let me know more in the comments below. And also you guys told me to move the difficulty uh how do i find the difficulty is it here no it should be here the difficulty to where's the difficulty uh settings here we go to superstar because you guys know i'm not that good on hall of fame so we are moving that to superstar so here we go let's start simulating some games let's get into this and i'm not gonna i think i will give most spades some minutes you guys said definitely give spades minutes over muscal you know what is muscal locked on a contract he is not. Damn, okay. Maybe we can still bring him back on the minimum. So, Siakam, you're not going to get any minutes now. We're just going to swap you out for Spates for the next week. And we're pretty much going to call it there. Amir Johnson will stay in the starting lineup. So, yeah. So, get we're going to simulate a game here against Memphis. I think we're going to get like a month into this video. Then we'll do the trade deadline next video. And then we'll get on with that. I'm not trading Moutier and Richardson for Derrick Rose. No, thank you. So, Let's see if we can pick up a win against the Grizzlies. I think we just played them, but we took the... I think we beat them. So, we're going to take the L here. We lost by 17. Very high-scoring game. Not a good defensive game by us. CJ Miles went 8 for 19 from the field. Emmanuel Moody, 12 points, 9 assists, but he had negative plus minus. Not very good. Tony Snell, 90 points. Dwayne Dedman with a double-double. Good to see. I think he could average a double-double, but we'll see what happens. Vince Carter dropped 21 on this. That is not very good when somebody of his age is dropping 21 on you. So, taking on the 1-3 Boston Celtics. They're not off to the start they would like. Can we not lose and ooh, close oh no we lose in overtime damn it okay we lost in four in overtime but good comeback by us in that fourth quarter and the third quarter cj miles up 26 points deadman 13 and 14 what moody do 14 assists I, you shot two for 15 from the field jesus you're terrible um isaiah thomas 29 and horford had 25 all right we're two and three i don't mind if we tank like i really don't mind at all if we do bad but like i would like to win games as we just gave up wow 60 points at halftime but so did we we scored okay it was close and that third quarter hurt us a lot we lose by nine not a good defensive game at all from us cj miles still with a great performance kyle corver 23 points eight boards five assists moody 14 5 and 8 Moody is still doing pretty well to start off the year. Like, 12 and 8 is pretty good. I would like for him to average double-digit assists. I don't think it's going to happen. But that's personally my goal for him. To average double-digit assists and for Deadman to average double-digit rebounds. That's pretty much all I want. So, let's simulate this game against the Pistons. Are we going to win? We're on, like, a three-game losing streak. Yes, we win this one by one point. A big third quarter comeback after a abysmal first quarter. Moody A drops 28. That's what I'm talking about, Moody A. But how... He's still at a negative 9 plus minus. Jeez. Kyle Corver at a plus 20 as he had 23 points. 7 for 9 from 3. That's what I'm talking about. Good game by Tony Snell. Amir Johnson double-double. 10 and 9 for Deadman. CJ Miles is hurt. Okay, it's okay to left finger. He can get over that, but he's our best player. So, we got to definitely need him to get over that. I'm going to leave the rotation as it is. Give him a big minute. Siakam, I think I'm going to leave him on the bench because he's on a rookie contract. Because So, I'd rather get what I can out of most spades that we can maybe flip him at the deadline. So, teams, we can see what, we can do, what he can do. And then we're going to probably move on from Amir Johnson. Johnson in the offseason, and then we can go along with, uh, what's his face, Siakam next year, so I did start this in the offseason, so I don't know if, like, KD switched teams or anything, but, no, we don't beat the Pacers, damn, oh my god, we choked hard in that fourth quarter, nine points, Tony Snell at 20, Sam with Corver, Moody 17 and 8, Deadman had, oh, really, he's gonna be here too, uh, not good, and Paul George dropped 27 on our heads, did, like, did people sign, I don't think anything big happened, yeah, so, like, is KD still on the Thunder, I think he should be, yeah, he's still, no, he's on the Warriors, never mind, he's on the Warriors, uh, that's what I meant to say, so, let's go here to the Wizards game, we're on a one-game losing streak now, after we were on, like, a three-game losing streak, let's see, okay, Deadman, I'm gonna keep the rotation as it is, can we pick up a win here against the Wizards, another Eastern Conference team, and it looks like we're gonna pick up the W, good, second half by us and a great second and third quarter really by us so um 
We went by, what is that, 15? I feel like I'm doing that math wrong. As CJ Miles drops 31, Deadman 9 and 11, even though he's hurt. Moutier, there we go, Moutier. If you can get in that 9 assist range, he's starting off really well this year as we pick up the win. I'm liking this team, guys. I like Tony Snell, too. 16 points for him as a six man. He's been really good for us. Corver, also 16 points. Yo, we're actually like a high scoring team. Are we like one of the more high scoring teams in the NBA? Stats, player stats, or team stats. Do we average like one of the most points a game? No, Seattle's five. They're six and one. Jeez. All right. We're, never mind. We don't average that much. We're 14. But yeah, the team is doing well scoring. I know it's only nine games. Like people are going to go down, but I'll take this. I take this. Uh, Deadman, I would like for him to get up in points, but it's okay. Take it on the Cavs. They're four and four. I'm expecting to get kind of blown out here. Even though we're at home, let's try to give our home fans a win. And you guys also said the quarter of the jerseys were really ugly. We lose by two. Jeez. All right, what are you going to do? This game was close. Moody played really well. It didn't shoot really good from the field. As Corver had a nice game. Wow, okay. I want to hop into a game soon. So I think we're going to simulate. We'll go up against who the hell. Okay, that was a weird glitch. I don't want to go up against the Supersonics again. But I want to play. We'll play the Nets. That's a game that I think we can easily win. So Maurice Spates. Is out two to four weeks, which since when you're going to have to play through it, more money. Come on. As uh, I'll see you guys at that game, and I'll kind of go over with everything. Ooh, we have to scout people. This is still the Lonzo draft class, yes. So, these are still the guys we're going to scout, as we can only we only have five scouting uh, points or whatever. So, I'm not doing that trade. Oh, damn. Okay. Moody is out two weeks. That's going to hurt. Tower Ennis, you're, go you're in the lineup. <laughs> Immediately, Tower Ennis, get in there. He just went from reserved to getting, he'll get like 28 minutes a game. We're going to give more to people on the bench now. We're probably going to give, I guess, a little bit to Justin Holiday because he could maybe play some point guard. So, yeah, I'll see you guys at that Nets game and I'll see how we did. All right, guys, so we're pretty much here at the date that I said I was going to simulate to. We are 11 and 15. We're the 12th seed. The injury bug has caught us kind of badly. Uh, what's his name? Just got back from his injury. Moutier, Space just got healthy as well. CJ Miles had a stream off the killie, so he's been out for like a month, but he's coming back now or half a month. He was doing so well in his minutes, so we're taking on the Nets here. We're going to play or simulate into the game. Muscala wants to come back, see if we can get him on the minimum. Tony Snell on the minimum. We're going to be nice. I definitely want to bring both those guys back. Definitely Tony Snell. So Lakers receive most spades. We get Kenyon Mar Kevin Martin. Kenyon? That's probably Kenyon Martin. Wait. Who is on the... Okay, voice crack. Pretty bad voice crack. Wait, is that Kenyon or Kevin Martin? Oh my god, where are the Lakers? Is that Kevin or Kenyon? Kevin Martin. Thought he retired, but that's pretty cool. Okay, so let's take on this Nets in a simcast. Let's simulate. And if it's a close game, I'd rather that happen, which it looks like it will be. As... Yeah, I'm going to hop into the game... I think sub five minutes. There we go. We're up by three with four minutes to go. I'll see you guys in the game. We're on Superstar, so I think I should be able to pick up the victory. Okay, guys. Maybe these jerseys are a little bit ugly. Not going to lie. They're not the greatest. If you guys want, let me know in the comments if we should maybe change up these jerseys. Tony Stell, 18 points. Sean Kilpatrick was left wide open. Okay, good board, Muscala. I got to get some subs in. I think we have to take out Tony Snell. Why is Amir Johnson playing small forward? That's where we're going wrong right now. And I guess Josh Richardson. Why is most Spades? See, this is the problem. This is the problem. Moody has no energy. So we're going to put Tower Ennis at point guard. We're going to put uh, Muscala at center. Just kidding. We're going to put Dwayne Dedman at center. Who's playing small forward for us? Jesus. Nobody has energy at all. Tony, Justin Holiday. I guess you are. Like, why does one, two, three, four, five guys have all 50 energy? Jesus. All right. This is the lineup we're going to roll with. I got to call a timeout because this, this can't happen. I know we might need that, but I can't have most spades playing shooting guard right now. I can't. So hopefully Tony Stout can maybe play the last minute or something like that. Same with Corver if they can get their energy up. So let's, um, I don't really want to do much of this timeout. Who's our head coach? I don't know. Is it somebody young? I didn't put Moody in. What? This is not the one. I hate this game sometimes, guys. I literally hate this game sometimes. Um, I'm I'm very frustrated right now, if you can see, as I don't know why that lineup went in. I didn't put that lineup in. All right, so we're going to try to foul immediately. Is there anybody in that I'm keeping in? I think it's Muscala is the only one. So I'm going to try to go to the rack with Muscala. Please get that in. Found me, found me. There we go. Thank you. Okay, so we're going to get free throws with Muscala. Moody has 22 points and 7 assists and 6 boards. He's playing really well this season. Okay, now we're going to get our subs in. The right people I want in. Uh, Tyler Ennis, Justin Holiday, interesting backcourt. Or no, Justin Holiday, yeah, he's in a small forward. Never mind. Josh Richardson, he's got 2 points, 5 boards, 7 assists. Deadman's got 5 boards, five points, 7 boards, and Muscala's got 2 points. I don't know why that's his only buckets there. I do like Muscala's game. I want him to be the... He's very, I guess, weak, you could say, for a small, uh, backup center, I guess. But 
Uh, you can just look at him on the court. Like, look how big, like, uh, who is that? Trevor Booker compared. And someone just got a tip stamp on this. Is that College Jefferson? I don't even know who that was. Uh, I think it was. So, Tower Ennis from the Syracuse. From the Syracuse. Let's get a nice pick and roll. Ooh, Tower Ennis. Roll, Muscala. Fine, Deadman. There we go. Easy dunk. Easy dunk, great Deadman. There we go. Okay, so we're up now by five points, which is very nice. I want to get Josh. You guys said if you get Richardson's release down, he turns into a beast. So I'm definitely going to work on that as watched. Look how predictable that is. Oh, should have been a steal. Why is Trevor Booker out there? We shouldn't care. That's going to go in. That was bad D by me. I thought he was going to pass it. So I was. I played back with Devin, but then he took the fade away. All right. I, I like it, Brooke Lopez. You, you, you worked on me right there. Josh Richardson. Let's try to get a pick and pop. Okay, no. Pick and roll with Deadman. Cross him up. Ooh. Ah, uh, not a good release, but Deadman's going to get the board. Easy buckets for Deadman. Easy buckets. He's going to be a beast on the boards for us. I think he's a free agent at the end of this year, so we're going to probably have to give him a decent amount of money if we want to bring him back. Because I give realistic contracts as well, guys. Like, if somebody's a really good player and they're asking for the minimum, I'm obviously not going to give them the minimum. Josh Richardson for three in transition. And eh, not a good release. Ah, uh, didn't go in. Ooh, good board, Tyler Ennis. Jay Rich again? Jay Rich again? Okay, maybe not. Maybe not. Maybe I got to work on his three-pointer because that was pretty much all white. And Jeremy Lin, that's a good pass by him. Hollis Jefferson misses that. Good board, Muscala. Let's run the break. Find Justin Holiday. And can somebody roll? I will give it to Ennis. Ennis, spin move. Kicking to Muscala in the corner. Muscala knocked that down. Muscala, ah, in and out. Okay, not a great shot. We're still up by five, though, which I like. And let's stop the ball. All right, Booker, that was probably going to happen no matter what. All right, three-point game, less than two minutes. Let's not blow this. Let's not blow this. I want to get the ball to Deadman in the post. Deadman, give me a nice pick or Muscala. Okay, we'll go pick and fade with Muscala. And Muscala roll. Ooh, good move, Mike Muscala. The spin move, he got right around Brook Lopez. Very nice job by Muscala there. All right, five. Uh, five point lead for us with a minute and a half left. Let's just walk up. Let's play good D. Deadman and Lopez in the post. Come on, Deadman, you're stronger. There we go, Deadman. Good stuff. Uh, find Jay Richardson, who's freaking f athletic as hell. Find Justin Holiday. There we go. Holiday! Holiday, I admire your athleticism because you were about to throw down a nasty dunk, but why'd you miss it, dude? Come on. Kilpatrick on Richardson. Richardson, stay with them. Stay with them. Stay with them. Jeremy Lin, don't get out there, Muscala. All right, give it to Deadman in the post. Come on, Deadman. You're a good post, T. There we go. Ah, the fadeaway is probably going to get to me. Yeah, he's not athletic enough to get there, but he's still strong. So if he wants to get a post move, it's not happening. Oh, there we go. Good pass, Tower Ennis. Finds the, uh, Dwayne Devin, who's almost at a double-double. But, yeah, so... Let's just walk up on Lynn. No threes. Definitely, we don't want any threes. No twos either, but, like... Oh, they're going right to Lopez. Come on, Devin. You're getting your work here on Lopez. Okay, he could D. Find Ennis on Lynn. Good D. Stay with them. Don't bail him out with a the foul. They're going pick and roll with Booker. It looks like I'm there. I'm there. Come on, Muscala. Good D on Devin again. No fouls. No fouls. There we go. Good poor Devin. There's his double-double. Fine, Richardson. Here we go. Here's the dunk. What the heck? Okay. You made that. But why didn't you just get into that dunk animation? All right, guys. We're going to pick up the win today. Pretty dope. So this is the box score. We saw Moody's numbers. Tony Snell, 18 points. He's having a really nice season. Corver, 16 points as well. He's shooting 50% from three. Jesus. Wow, okay. Amir Johnson. I might move him at the deadline if a team wants some. So people are probably going to move at the deadline. Is Azili... And CJ Miles and possibly Kyle Corver and um who is that other guy? Kyle Corver and who and Mir Johnson. So those four players, I think I'm gonna look at the deadline. If I can get a first round pick for CJ Miles, I would love that. So yeah, like if looking at this, I want to keep Moody A. Uh, Kyle Corver's on the block. Tony Snell wanna keep. Amir Johnson wanna trade. Deadman wanna keep. Trade. Don't really care. Wanna keep Richardson. Wanna keep Muscala. Wanna keep Siakam. Okay, so here we go. I'm gonna go to Untouchables. Right now we have Moody A. As actually nobody's really an untouchable, but I'm going to leave Deadman and Moutier there because I really want them to be, like, the core of this team. Also, I don't plan on moving Tony Snell. I like his game. I want to keep him. And I think that's it. And Muscala. Right now, they're untouchables. I'm not moving them as of now. So, also, let's go to Trade Block. We're going to throw up Amir Johnson. We're going to throw up Corver. We're going to throw up Azili. Well, uh, no, not Spates. We're going to throw up Azili. And we're going to throw up... CJ Miles, can I do that even though he's hurt? Yep, and we'll throw up, honestly, most spades, because why not? All right, so we have that figured out, and yeah, so that's going to be for me. I hope you guys enjoyed episode two. We're 12 and 15 on the year. We're probably not going to make the playoffs, but we might fight for an 18 or something. We're only, like, a game out of the 18, so definitely possible. So that's going to be for me. I hope you guys enjoyed. Let me know in the comments what you guys thought. Let's try to get 750 likes again on this episode for episode two. I love you guys. I'll see you guys in episode three. Subscribe if you're new. I'll see you guys in episode three.